A fucking moment for me is remembering that like this is like a hustle for real. Your 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 family is gonna ask you dumb questions to kind of like validate you. And you can't pay attention to none of that because they don't really know what's going on. You know what I'm saying? They're gonna ask you like, are you on like YouTube or some dumb shit like that? Like, yeah, I'm on I'm on YouTube. So, so what, you know what I mean? Or like they're asked if you work with like, you know, fill in the blank or somebody like that. So my fucking thing is just like, I know what I'm doing and I know that it's, it's gaining some type of ground. You know, if my family and friends can celebrate it with me, that's cool. If they can't, then that's, that's cool too. But you know, fuck it. Something that fans might know, not know about me. I used to be dog as hell at baseball. Like I was like for real serious. I thought I was gonna go, you know, up until like 10th grade. And then I was just like, man, I don't wanna do this anymore. This is stupid. Why am I running? I'm tired. I don't wanna do this no more. But I used to be like super into baseball. I was real cold. I used to, you know, have like MVP joints and shit like that. Play summer ball, started in March, all that shit. So I was, I was real nice with baseball. I don't know if you guys even give a fuck about that, but that's something that. I'm into, so. The position I played was everything. Like, I was like, I was cold, man. I'm telling you, like, for real. Like, I was playing shortstop. Uh, I pitched a little bit. I might have started off a couple times. Um, center field, like, all key positions. Like, no pussy shit. Like, it's like, uh, like 330 or something like that. Three, yeah, 340 or something like that. I was straight, man. Like, I was, I was decent, you know what I'm saying? Like. I was at one point where I was like super into like films and stuff like that. Um, this was like last year. And it wasn't necessarily, it might've been 80s, but it was like, uh, I was like trying to get like underground black exploitation type shit. I was just bored at the crib, man. I was, I was actually writing to uh, Whole Foods and I had, you know, time on my hands to try to make stuff. So I was like looking up, you know, like black exploitation stuff that I never seen before. And uh, that's kind of where my like, oh shit, this is a whole world that I never um, delved into. So um, it's kind of because of making Whole Foods that I kind of start, you know, digging that, digging into, you know, that shit. School should be about exploring all talents. It should be about exploring all crafts and making all, pos all opportunities possible. And when you cut out anything out of the programs, you, you, you minimizing the, the chances of somebody to become successful. One of the first conversations I, I had with him, you know, he, he loved my uniqueness. He loved my originality. You know, he always said I was an icon down to my, my Staly logo. If you ever seen the Staly logo, you know, he's like, man, you an icon. That logo should be everywhere. And he always used to say, don't let anybody tell you what you can't do. Make your decision today for three weeks from now for the best possible result. That way you'll know that uh, instant gratification, nine times out of 10, ain't gonna last you and, and, and ain't gonna get you what you need. Put that work in. Take the steps, not the elevator. He's like, man, I really gotta piss, I really gotta piss. And I'm like, it's all good, bro, just piss in this bottle. So I gave him like a Snapple bottle and I take the steering wheel. So I'm driving while he's pissing because he's gotta go, he's just gotta go. You know what I mean? It's not like he can hold it, it's like an emergency. 